don't look good. What is it? I had a bad dream. Bad dream? You, you died again? Yes. No. No, God forbid. It can't happen to you. Not again. See, babe, we, we need to start praying so hard in this family to dismantle the evil plans of the enemy in our family. Okay? Babe, you will not die. You will live to proclaim the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Nothing will happen to you. Okay? Good. Honey. Yeah. I'm expecting my baby soon. Wow. I can't wait to see my baby after all those years. Hmm. But I'm scared. I don't know if I'm going to make it to alive. Come see. on. Stop saying this. You're going to make it alive. Nothing will happen to you. Why are you talking like this? I have a confession to make. Confession to make? What are you talking about? You've been a good man to me. You've been a good husband to me all these years. You've shown me love more than I even deserve. You deserve everything you're getting from me. Even more. I have to make this confession before I go into labor. Come on, what confession are you talking about? You're scaring me. It all started when I was... <laughs> what? 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 Come on, come on. Easy, easy, easy. Just hold on a minute. Just hold on. Benjamin, come let's play ball. Benjamin. 
Come, let's play ball. Can't you see I'm busy? Why are you always busy? What is wrong with you? Twins play together and do everything together. But you are the only twin that doesn't play with your brother. Tencent, please go and play with your books. I don't know how you feel when you take last position in the class when I take first. Oh, are you mocking me? So you're mocking me, right? It's not what you think. I'm just saying at least we are supposed to be studying together. Maybe when we get to school, I can take first position while you take second or third. Okay, so you're calling me an illiterate. So I'm not worthy to take first position, right? That's what you mean. I'm not worthy. Tensel, it's not what you think. I'm sorry. Don't worry. Mom will hear about this. I don't understand you confessed. You know, uh, your money is jovial. You know, we are a very jovial boy. This one, where your face can't be like this today. What's going be the problem? Who provoke you? Benjamin insulted me because I'm not intelligent. Why, why Benjamin would do something like that, nah? It's, it's not my fault that I'm not intelligent. I try to read my books every day. But I can't learn a simple word in it. I can't understand anything. Make you not worry yourself. Because even me, you can't no say you read your book all the time. Eh? I will make you know, say, with time, you go improve, you go still get better. Eh? But come to think of it. Not be everybody could go to school. Oh? You could not worry yourself at all. The other day, my daddy called me a useless boy just because I'm not intelligent. Your papa did waiting. But your papa called you useless. No, nah, no, nah, eh. Make you calm down. Eh? I de promise you, say, with time, you go, go sabi book, go, go. Oh? You go get better with time. Eh? Make you just the day serious, they read your book all the time. Oh? Make you, make you share up now. Eh? Make, 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 make you smile for me. Oh? Smile now. Okay, my need to VL. Smile now. I never see the smile. <laughs> you smile again. <laughs> Good boy. Oh yeah, I will make you go inside now. Yeah. Later, me and you qua go line qua. Make we talk more qua on this particular thing. You understand? They go inside. I will see you. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Intelligent boy. Nah, uh, I don't even understand this my yoga at all, self. People will go to school, no get to work. Now you did here yeah, instead of you make you from now they teach this small boy hand work. Make you learn one or two skills. The first I'm saying go go to school. Who school help? People will go to school, they get work, oga. Oga, you don't deliver God though. See you eh? my but God will make me and you oga. I don't mark your face, God. Not, uh, I hope there's no problem. 
How was my child? Mr. Johnson? Your wife is having complications. No. Your wife is having complications and she needs immediate CS right now. Like she needs to undergo a CS right now. Oh, no. Not again. Not again. I, I, we tried all that we could. But I think she needs to undergo this CS right now and as quick as possible. You know the procedures. So when you sign the papers, we can commence immediately. Doctor, just get me the paper. Let me sign it then. All right. This way. What is happening? How is my child? I hope he's fine this time around. Your wife had a complication. Complication again? What is going on? I, I, I hope nothing happens to my child. I'm sorry, we lost him. You did what? But your wife is fine. I am not talking about my wife, I'm talking about my child. I'm sorry, we tried all we could. But we couldn't save him. But your wife is perfectly okay. I, I, I'm Mr. Johnson, you, you don't need to take it too hard like that. You still have your wife. Calm down. Don't stop bitching me. And don't you dare drag me back again. I'm done. I'm tired of all this. Things. What is what is this rubbish? What's going on? Mr. Johnson? Johnson, what has come over you? I mean, since when do you turn to a drunk? Why are you doing this to yourself, man? She lost my child again. Well, I went to the hospital and I heard about it. But that shouldn't be the reason you should drink yourself to death. I just want to drink away my sorrow. Drink away your sorrows, you mean? Huh? See, Johnson, things are not done that way, okay? I mean, I mean, on the contrary, you're only drinking yourself into more sorrows, my friend. Huh? You should stand up and fix things. I face the challenges of life, my friend. Huh? Of what value is my life when I don't have a child? Please, just leave me alone, okay? Johnson. Johnson. Who told you that children define the real um, value of a man? Huh? See, you're taking things too far and it's not good for you. It's high time you, you know, act like a man you are. See, you have to stop drinking and let's leave here. Just leave me alone and go away, okay? Just go away and leave me alone. I am not going anywhere without you. I'm living here with you, okay? Bye, oh, man. Another one. Get for it. Get
Why did you break my trophy? Why did you do this to me? What good did I do to you? Why did you do this to me? Stop! Mom! Stop it! I did not break your trophy! Now leave me alone! Leave me alone! Mom! Mom! It was a mistake! I said it was a mistake! What's going on? It was a mistake! What? Mom! 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 It was a mistake. Mistake. What? He broke my trophy! Kinsley, <laughs> how could you do a thing like that? Mom, it was a mistake. I was cleaning the house and the trophy mistakenly broke. Mom, he's lying. He's lying. Kinsley has always been jealous of me. Shut up. How could you say a thing like that? Why would your brother be jealous of you? How can I be jealous of my twin brother? It was a mistake. Oh, now you know I'm your twin brother. Um, Benjamin, it's okay. You have to believe your brother, okay? Okay. Can't you see he's crying already? That means he is sorry. Mom, he intentionally did it. This is how he insults me and call me an illiterate. It's okay. What? It's okay. I don't want to hear any more words from you both. Benjamin, apologize to your twin brother. But he's the one that brought... Shh, shh, shh. Do it right now. I'm sorry. <gasps> Kinsley, apologize to Benjamin for breaking his trophy. I'm sorry. Good. Now, you two, I don't want you fighting anymore. Okay? You should learn to grow in love. Okay? Okay. Good. It's just a trophy. It can be replaced. I trust you, right? You can do better and win yourself another one. Okay? All right. Come on. Go to your room, boys. Mommy. It's okay. Come on. <laughs> I noticed you're angry at your wife. There's no need to be. She's also going through a hard time. All you need to do for her right now is to show her more love and care. Doctor, I love my wife. But it has not been easy at all. I don't know what to do with the end and all this. Mr. Johnson, your wife will be fine. And medically, you're fine too. This is just a test of time for you. And it shall pass too. Doctor, she has not been talking. But she can move her fingers. I hope she will find I've done everything necessary, medically, for her to regain her consciousness. Mr. Johnson, I know you to be a very devoted Christian. You need to pray for her, constantly. 
One thing is for medical practitioners to discharge their duties. Another thing is for God to heal. So please, always pray for her. She will be fine. The doctor said we both are going to give birth at the same time. Hmm. Since the doctor said that, I've been thinking. About what? Um, I could have twins and save you the shame of being a single mother. This sounds too good to be possible. How do you intend to go about it? Okay, I already have a plan. I'll get a nurse to carry out the whole process. But you have to promise to keep your mouth shut. Jennifer. Thank you so much. Thank you so, so much. If you do this for me, I will ever remain grateful to you. Oh, all right. Thank you. <laughs> mm. right. I'm afraid you are. Eh? What if the doctor tells your husband about this? The doctor? No. I'm not going to get the doctor involved in this. Like I said, I'll get a nurse to carry out the whole plan. So you don't have anything to worry about. Okay? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, it's fine. Hi, babe. Welcome. Are you looking for something? Where is the trophy that I kept here? Benjamin's trophy. Um, babe, you know, Kinsley mistakenly broke it. What? He broke it? Why? Eh? And what took him there at the first place? Babe, don't worry. I already disciplined him. I hope you, you dealt with him enough. Hmm? I hope you dealt with that idiot, that fool. Come on, babe. Mind your words. That boy is just a little boy. And besides, it's, it's just a, a common trophy. It's not like it's the egg of life. A trophy that was presented to him by the state governor. Is that what you refer to as just? I don't blame you. If you know how hard people suffer to attract such recognition, you wouldn't have made light of it. Excuse me. Where is he? Can't sleep. No, I mean Benjamin. Where is he? Babe, I've told you this countless times. These boys are twins. I mean, you don't need to love one more than the other. It will end up bringing hatred amongst them. But you know that Benjamin has brought me more joy than I ever imagined. Where is he, please? Okay. Where are they? They went for the extramoral lesson. They will soon be back. Okay. I would love to see that boy, Kinsley. I would love to see him so that uh, I will know why he would break that. Uh, Johnson. Hello, Mama. Hello, Johnson. 
Kere Kunumer, how is my daughter? What well, she delivered yesterday? Eh? Hey! Kere de richuku, kere de richuku. Hey, chupi mela. Um, umwa kene kwa motara. But she lost the baby. Hey, Chimo, again? God, why? Eh? Um, how is my daughter? I hope she is okay. She has been in coma. Eh? Coma? How? Chimo? Chimo? Nai! Nai! I will show you the stuff I am made of. No problem. No. No, there is problem. Oh. There is a very big problem. Oh. What problem? I just received a call from Johnson. He, he said that our, our daughter our daughter is in coma. I hope nothing happened to the baby. She lost it. She lost the baby. Oh, after nine months. Oh, evil man! Is that all you can do? No problem. I am coming for you right now, and I will teach you the lesson of your life! Nine. What is it? Where are you going to? I know my enemy. Nine! Nine! Hey! Hey! Not again! Eh? After nine months! Again! Ibeka! Ibeka! Oh, oh, I thought you have totally gone dead! Eh? After all I told you! You see said good to that land! I told you this, we discussed this, we discussed, and you still went and sent people to my land. Why? So you carried this madness to my house. Eh? Are you sure you are okay? I have come to warn you with my madness. Stay away from my land. <laughs> if you don't get away from my house, I will pour my venom on you. Are you talking to me? I am talking to that rat here. <laughs> now, for the very last time, since you have refused to make me have peace, you shall not have peace in this land. I promise you, stay away from my land. Ibeka, stay away from my land. Shut up! You know I'm going to crush you like a cricket. Try come to my house next time and you will see what I will do to you. Stupid. Child. Life. Wicked. The world. Unfair. What have I gained in all my days of good deeds and perfect life? This time. I don't care. Anyone that comes my way will get it hot. Obia Jolo. Obia Jolo. Since you have decided to die before your time, then I am ready to give it to you the way you like it. Ibeka is a wicked man. I'm suspecting that he has a hand in what is happening to my daughter, Regina. I have told you to stop living your life on mere assumption. At this time and age, you should be certain about some important issues. I don't understand what you mean. Okay. I went to the chief priest and made some inquiries from Ogugu. I hope it has nothing to do with me or any member of my family. It's about uh, our daughter, Regina. I have told you countless times 
that I don't want to have any business with charms and shrines. I told you, didn't I? You are my elder brother. And I want to mislead you. It's for your own good. And also for the betterment of our family. I don't want to hear from Ogugu. I don't want to hear from Ogugu. One thing I hate about you is your stubbornness. When you came back from Kenya, I was about telling you something about your wife. But you never care to listen to whatever I or anyone else wants to say about her. <laughs> I wouldn't have been living with her now. If I listen to your gossips here and there, that means she would have been in her father's house. And only God knows what would have become of me. Because I would have married another woman who could have been worse. We must understand that we are humans and we could make mistakes. It's all right. Continue living your life like a blind man, walking on railways when you have two functional eyes. It's all right. Continue. When you finally decide to act like a man, then you can call me. If acting like a man means that I will be gossiping from here to here and that I will chase my wife away, then moving from one little doctor to another. Hello? I want to remain a woman. Let me have my leave now. You can go. so happy to have you as a son. Hmm? You came out the best in your grade and that made them to select you as among the few that will represent your school in the forthcoming state quiz competition. That's so noble of you. Thank you so much. Thanks, eh? High five. Mm -hmm. oh. High five. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> so I got something for you. Taking them out. Wow. Wow. Good clothes for you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So Hold on. You check them out later. Let's keep things. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Best. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I want to tell you something. Sit down. I want you to promise me one thing. I want to that. You're going to win the competition. Promise me that. I promise you. You promise you, right? I trust you. I want you to study hard, right? Study hard, win the competition. I will take you to Zanzibar. One week vacation in Zanzibar. If you win, enjoy yourself. I will take you to Bahamas. After school, you go to Canada or UK to go and study. Hmm? I will never be a black sheep. I will never be a black sheep. <laughs> I trust you, boy. Daddy. Where is my own clothes? Oh, well, I did not buy for you. Oh yes, I didn't buy for you because you are yet to improve. I want you to improve, okay? Come on, honey. This is not fair. Yeah? It's not fair. What is not fair? Huh? I want him to change. I want him to change. Look at his brother, he's doing us proud in school. I cannot be buying things for someone that is dull. I cannot be buying things for someone that takes the last position. I don't like the way he's so dull in class, in class and in, even in the things of life. Eh? Let me tell you something. If you don't do something now, it will affect his personal development. And that is what I'm doing. Well, you should know you cannot change a child with words that sounds like hate speech. It only worsen the whole situation. All he needs from us is time, patience, and love. For crying out loud, I don't like this. 
babe, I'm not. I, I don't hate anyone. Hmm? I, I, I like him as my son, but he needs to improve. That is what I'm, I, I'm saying. He needs to improve. He's, eh? so, unfair. He's so dull, it's so, unfair. so unfair. Are you not seeing it? No, it's very unfair. I what is your problem? You. What? Casely. What is my problem? You are, you are the mother, eh? Take care of them. Teach him what to do. Excuse me. Just you don't have to cry about this. You have to read your books. I can't read. Don't you get it? I can't read. I try every time to read my books, but I can't understand it like you do. I'm not as intelligent as you are. Maybe. Maybe it's because I'm foolish and useless. No, you are not foolish and useless. You are my brother. I'm my twin brother for that matter. I am not your brother. Point of correction, I am not your brother. Now, get away. What have I done wrong? You know I love you so much. <sighs> no, you don't. You don't love me. If you loved me, you wouldn't have let dad to hate me. He doesn't hate you. He doesn't hate you. Yes, he do, and you do too. And now get out of my sight. I say get out! <sighs> Fine. This guy to win, she don't resemble a This guy to win, she not body me, she Get out of my sight! You make dad hate me so much! And you still want me to be happy about that! No resemblance at all. Not even to play together. They don't have things in common. But what is wrong? What is the case? One is all other. What is the case? I see no Papa, please take it easy on me. My car, but you're not the man, police. You got the one, my cotton. See, I put you in the phone, Papa. But you're not the man, police. You got the one, my cotton. See, I put you in the phone, Cause this life is full of mystery. No one knows tomorrow at all. I want to get me to get chase a chinine. Cause what is hidden is too much for a man to see. If I want to go get a man, I want to get a man. Mm. Son is back. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. Okay, sir. Yeah, thank you. Um, see me. I want to send you to get something. From you. All right, sir. All right, sir. What he needs is love and care. Show him love and care. Go be in the yama. Go be in the yama. Go be in the yama. Yes, sir. Show first. It breaks his heart. Show him some love. Show now. Eh? Think could be your problem. Why can't they make it more? You know, go go inside, make you follow your brother, celebrate. He has won the competition. My dad is taking him to Zanzibar. And he's going to leave me because I'm a useless dance. I don't tell you this thing time and time again. Make you know they talk down on yourself. Eh? I won't make you understand, see, you get power there for your mouth. You get power way there for the way, the way they talk. If you call yourself champion, you go be champion. If you call yourself failure, you go be failure. What? Make you know they bring yourself down. Now, as my guy, where you be, and I mean they tell you, me happy. Go inside, make you follow your brother celebrate. Don't worry. Let's play. 
Hein? Comme, comme, je donne de l'us garde. Comme hier. Non, hein? Non, hein? Il donne de l'us garde. Il donne de l'us garde. Go inside, mais il faut aller à Rejoice. Oh? Your brother is a champion today. Tomorrow you will be champion. You will rotate. Let's go. Go flam, celebrate. Oh? You know the loose guard. You be my guy. Now I'm happy to talk now. Don't be me again. Go, your own go come. I'm not even going understand this kind. It's kind of nonsense, hatred and bitterness away from this family. I'm going to go to Jamaica. I'm going to go to this home. No peace, no unity for this small house. See the kind of problem one of the cause between small, small children. I'm going to show them love what they deserve. Money day, love no day. Every day, quanta, quanta, fight, fight. For everybody where is you, Oga, and Madame, and everybody where they this house, including me, but I don't want to face faces to God. So I'm going to say, come by and soft drink. A soft drink, they use for the best ambition. This is for you, huh? Monster sex. Oh! <laughs> oh <my laughs> All right. Uh -huh. I will pray for you now. Let me dish out this for you. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yes. All right. Happy uh -huh. So, cheers to good life. Cheers to more awards, Ooh. more trophies, <laughs> more international recognition. <laughs> to my brilliant son. I love you so much. Eh? I love you so much. Eh? I'll take you abroad. Don't worry. <laughs> you spend money. I'll provide you. Eh? More of this. More of this. I'm, I'm, I'm grateful. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. Cheers, uh. babe. Yes. Mm -hmm. You good? Wow. Are you sure? Yeah, this is good life. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. Enjoy yourself, right? Mm -hmm. Come, so I'm going you, daddy. I'm going to sit you, daddy. Uh -huh. So how are you? Don't worry, don't worry. I'll, I'll, I'll take care of you. Don't worry yourself. All right. What is the case? One is all other. Aye. What is the case? I see no matter who was. Papa, please take it easy on me. My car. When you're not in the police, you got it from my customer. You made mommy and daddy hate me. So I will make you pay for doing this to me. I will make you pay for being more intelligent than I am. them play together but in their own case is different no resemblance at all not even to play together they don't have things in common but what is wrong i don't know what is the case one is all other what is the case? I see no matter who was. Papa, please take it easy on me. My car. When you're not there, my police got the one my customer. Ah, Jennifer. How are you? Mom, I'm fine, and you? I'm not fine, no. 
I want to tell you something. Mama, please. Please. I don't have money this period. Why did you say that? Eh? You would have allowed me to say what I wanted to tell you. You should have cut some off. Mama, I have to tell you ahead of time. I don't have money. Things are really very hard this period. And you need to cut down the way you ask for money. Eh? Your sister is not well. She's not feeling fine. That is the reason I called you. I don't know if you've heard about it or not. What? Are you serious? Has she given birth? You better go and find out by yourself. Imagine. Gina. <laughs> Excuse me. Why did you condemn my clothes like this? And who told you that I did it? You are the one that did it. No, I'm not. I will pay for it. Even if I did anything, you will not do anything to me. And now leave me alone or I break your head. No. Leave me alone! Stop. Leave me alone! Stop, 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 you want to tell your brothers? Nah. I don't tell Una before, I want you to talk to me again. Una two, Una brothers, brothers not supposed to fight. They're not brothers. Eh? They're not brothers. You don't lose guard. No fight, no, no, no ever try fight your brother again. I, nah, eh? I don't talk, Una, they fight. Una just, they, Una just, they make them more. Nah. What am I? Nah. What am I? What am I? Is mama telling me the truth? Or oh, is she looking for a means to collect money from me? <sighs> Mama's love for money has made it so difficult for us to know when she's serious. <sighs> Gina. Saw my clothes. Why did you do this to your brother's clothes? Mom, he's lying. I did not tear any clothes. He's lying? Yes. Who could have done this if not you? You know your father will skin you alive if he noticed what you did to your brother's clothes. Everybody hates me. Everybody hates because you. Because I'm not intelligent. Oh. Is that why you're spoiling everything in this house? Eh? Take your nonsense slippers. You're lucky. You're... Ma madam, uh, madam, see this thing where this boy they do so, eh? And this kind of behavior what they call loose guard. And this loose guard, when they lose guard so. I know why in the duam and I get solution to the problem. What? Mm -hmm. You have solution. Please, if you have solution to this problem, solve it. Solve it because I don't know what this boy is turning into. Ah. I'll tell that one thing to to my fine clothes. Ah, 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 ah. Come here. Come. You, you, you don't have to tell your dad. Okay? You know what? I will buy you two new sets of clothes. Okay. Thanks, Mom. Yes, before your dad comes back, okay? This will be our little secret. Hmm? Good. Where your slippers? Aban or Abati, whatever your name is called, make sure you find a solution to this problem because this boy is turning into something else. What is all this? Huh? This girl. 
No, I, I, this this thing why they, they call me Appan for this house. My name is Appan. But you see, but you know they do me baptism. You know they call me Appan. I, I be like a boy. No, uh, for this for this nonsense to get in way to lose God for this house. My but God will make me and you. Eh? I, I don't mind. I, I won't tell you again. Eh? Nobody hates you. Eh? Your papa no hates you. Make you no come the demo the like this. My daddy doesn't like me. But I love him so much. Kingsley, you get what I want to clear you, eh? You get something we be say, if you do and do and well, you go feel me in your papa heart, make your papa begin like you. How? Like, what do you mean? I'm not intelligent. I wish I am as intelligent as Benjamin. Uh, uh, true, say Benjamin is a book pass you. But you get some things where you sabi do pass Benjamin. Yeah? And you see all those things where you sabi do, where your twin brother knows sabi do. If you do them and do them well, everybody for this house could begin to love you. Yeah? Yes. Please. Please tell me. Please. Just tell me what I can do. Tell me what I can do so my dad will love me again. You know, see, you and my guy. Eh? And you and a very jovial boy. You man is very jovial. I know you feed it for this house. May you come to this guard. Come my clear you well. You can't take us. Okay. Are you okay? What was it that you were telling me on phone? Hey, my sister. She lost her pregnancy. Oh, not again. Huh? I'm sorry about it, okay? Babe, she's even in coma as we speak. Oh, this is bad. What is really happening to Gina? Eh? Must she go through this every year? I think she needs spiritual help. Babe, I need to go see her tomorrow. Okay. Very well, that's fine, okay? I will, um, I'll send money to your account later today so that you can give to her husband. Extend my regards to them. That man has suffered a lot. Sorry. Thank you. You're welcome. It's fine. Okay? So how are my boys? Hmm? Alright, B. The boys. Benjamin is fine. Of course, I know he's the only one you care about. No. I care about it, so. Hmm? Don't worry, everything will be fine, okay? Hmm? I don't even understand you at all. Eh? All the time you could, you could cry for this house. Eh? You will be my guy. We will be say on a normal you will be a trivial boy. Go oh, here, Conde. This thing that they call the greedy pig greedy. You know they do well again. I got you something. I'm sorry. I got you something. Okay. What is this? Now, 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 my two months salary, now you see, so I save a mop. Come carry and buy this football kit for you. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Um, as you see, I'm so, eh? You are just there inside. You are this thing there inside. Everyone should got there inside. So I want me to go prepare where now. May you go kit up. Eh? My carry you go enter field. My coach guide you well. Thank you. Eh? Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. 
I will never forget this in my life. Yeah. Make you know if you go there and I could go begin the play all oh, like in that scenario. All oh, these are just nonsense boys, you understand? No, I will not do that. Why you play well, oh, eh? <laughs> Alright, I go and prepare. Look, I can't even go meet coach. I go let my side away for you. Make you know if you go there and I could go begin the loose guard, they play like Arsenal. In the bet, you are too odd. You need to give me a waste. You have no, no try. I will just. I will just. Nah, eh. I will just provoke. Oh. Nah, me say, if we want carry person enter football, I know if we some people are. Very useful, very useful. Let go over by C way. Pop nine. No be me again. <laughs> My You can't visit me. I, I, I hope I'm safe. I'm, I'm, I'm very safe. Eh? I do here now. Don't be me again. This person wait the see so. This top nine wait the see so. Now my master Pekin. Okay. Eh? Mm. A strong baller. Only I'm to ball up. I'm mad. Nice, nice. This, this a bit play ball well, well, well. And you, based on who you be, as person with the harness talent. Because you know, say, you don't pick many people from streets. Come, come, come convert them into international four stars. Eh? I won't make you work on this boy. Uh, oh, make you forget something good out of him. Apathy. Eh? You know, that's what I do for a living. Yes. Uh, boy, what's your name? My name is Kinsley. Kinsley. And I am a Chukwende Naji. Mm. Hmm? You're welcome to Tomorrow's Star Football Academy. Thank you. You're welcome. I must thank you for bringing him. You know me very well. You know me very well. Bringing this boy here. A very big risk I take. And I took that risk for the betterment of the future of this boy. Yeah? Because if my madam here say I carry and come this place, I feel lose my job. But I decided to take the risk. Yeah? Look, if I help this boy, anything what if you do for this boy, eh? Do him for him, I beg. How about this, sir? I wonder. You know me even before now? Yes. And you know that uh, I am good at what I do. I, I, I can so, bet on that. Mungu ninku. If this boy here is talented, just like you said. Yes. I promise you, those people will thank you later for this. I believe you. I do, do believe you. Do you understand? Mungu ninku. Boy, you're welcome. Hmm? Kings. Join the boys. Kings. Yes. How many times I call you? Kingsley. Yes. Go show them what you got. Okay, now you can. Go show them something. Yes. Top nine. Bola. Abati. What's your what's your first touch here now? What's your first touch here? Move on, move on. If your first touch, yeah? Where, where if your body you movement, if your body movement. Your if your skills. <laughs> Abati. It's not the skills. Abati. I have told you, stop stop calling my name. Short, short. Call my name. Say, well, now you call. I'll get back to you. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get back to you. Watch your skills here now. Watch, Watch your skills. Bola. Kinsley, wear your boots. Why you show them something? Who's guard? Who's guard? I don't want to appear so. Who's guard? It's me! It's me, Kingsley! I don't hear your voice. Hey, 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 hey. This is why I feel like this. What is the secret? Hey, I'm the highest goal scorer in my team today, and I scored three goals! <laughs> Papilo, <laughs> I know say one day you can make us proud. <laughs> my coach said that I'm becoming the best player in my team. Come on, take it away. I know tell you, I don't tell you before, say, not true, say you know through Sabi book for school. Hey, man, it's a volleyball. But for the field of play, you want a first class. You want a professor for football. <laughs> you okay. make me proud. Thank you so much. I don't want to make you to thank me. The only thank you what I want from you now make you to train well, they prepare well, make you for come out as the best footballer for this country. Okay, eh? I promise I will. I know say you know if you fall my hand, the mm. money the jovial. Eh? What I want to make you do now? I want to make you go inside now. Eh? You take your bed, you wash your jersey, wash everything, okay. still wash your uh, football boots, then you go prepare well. For the forthcoming match. Okay. If you reach there, you could show them saying that you'll be the top nine. Mm -hmm. When you could see a logo, eh? 
You download the net, your body called the net. Can you call it your body called the net? Body! Who shot the body called the net? Body called the net. You want me to like this, like this, like this? I should go. Okay. That's my boy. Top nine, top nine. Now, all this, all this, all this, all this, all this, all this nonsense where my mother did do for this house. Because this very, very smart boy. Who knows? Very soon now, if he become the top nine, I go, I go change this work. If he become football agent, now we're going to millions of pounds. So, so, want to sign my boy? Now it's 13 million pounds. Madam, for this loose guard, where they loose guard me for this house, my Abba to God, where make me and you, eh? I don't like your face, Madam. If you want to plug this one to three plus one, it goes to two. Did you get it? And um, three minus, minus one, one is equals to two. two. Mm -hmm. You're getting it. Then when you come here, you check this one. This one is two times four. Hey! Minus hey! One is two. That is good of me. And what is the meaning of that? Huh? I said, what's the meaning of that? Can't you see how dirty you're looking? And you are... I, I, I used to be... Now get out of here also! Oh, get out! I said, get, get out! Get out of here! Go upstairs and, and, and clean up yourself. I don't, I, don't, I don't want to see you anywhere close to my seat again. Did you hear what I said? Foolish boy. I said, go upstairs now! And you're looking at me. I, I, I used to be... Can't you see how dirty he is? Eh? Stupid boy. I've told him to always read these books. No, he will not read these books. He wants to play ball. He wants to do this. He wants to do that. Let me see you close to my seat again. Oh, yeah. He's okay. Let's continue. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Huh? It's fine. I don't want you to be like him. No. Mm -hmm. So, read your books. Listen. I will take you abroad. Say it I'll, again. I'll take you to UK. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. Hmm? I'll take you to UK. If possible. From UK, then when you finish your, your BSc, you go to Canada and do your master's. Thank you. After Canada, if you want to practice in Canada or you want to practice in the States, anyone else, I have the money, I'll, I'll, I'll foot the bills for you. So you have to promise me that you will be the best brilliant student yes. one of the best brilliant students did you hear what i said uh -huh. so let's continue god please forgive me forgive me for my wrongdoings forgive me for misleading my child I regret everything that I have done. Please have mercy on my child. Do not punish her for this. Instead, punish me. I'm willing and ready to accept the punishment. Alone, I will kill him by myself because the, 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 the flat that refused to, 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 to listen to our advice, he will follow the corpse to the grave. I am saying it, and I am lost here. You see, Becca now, you see, Becca, he is looking for my trouble. He, Becca, is looking for my trouble. My, oh. please, eh? I, oh. I, I, I suggest you report him to the elders, let them look into the matter. I have reported to uh, Okandu and Okongwa. And yet, he is still out of my land. He is looking for my trouble. And we deal with him. <clears throat> but that man used to be responsible. Lord. He just changed after the he, he lost his family. Was that the one that killed his wife? Was that the one that killed his children? Why is he always picking on me? Why is he always looking for my trouble? Hey! Mm. Nah. It's not only our land, though. 
I heard her that he sold Nkemakolo's house. Even Tanaka's uh, land, he sold it to. I, I wonder what he is using those money for. I would rather die than have him sell my land. No, nothing will happen to him. You will not die. I suggest that you report it to the Omona or even to the king, if possible, so that they will look into the matter and warn him. I will not beg him, oh. I will not beg him to stop trespassing my land. I will not beg him, but he will not leave to tell the story. She's speedily responding to treatment, but she needs more time to fully recover. Doctor, the whole thing is taking too much time. Mr. Johnson, you should be thanking God. Yes, she survived it. It better stay too long and get well than not get better at all. You should be thanking God and not complain. I will go back to my office and I shall return when she wakes up. This is serious. I wonder why my sister is going through this pain. Before this happens, she told me that she has something confidential to tell me. But she never said it till this moment. Could it, could it be that it has something to do with what is happening right now? I don't even know what you think right now. I'm losing my mind. I'm just losing it. I've waited. I've waited for years. And this keeps repeating itself. Oh, my goodness. I don't want anything to happen to my sister. God, please. <sighs> Uh, Ibeka. Mm. Obi Ajoro reported you to us. He even threatened to report the matter to the king. That's why we are here. Bam. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. You mean you came to my house? Just to tell me that Obi Ajo reported me to you people. Mm. Mm. Uh -huh. Okay, so you want me to forfeit my land because one idiot threatened to report me to the king. But that land does not rightfully belong to you. And you know it. Hey. Who told you that? Ibeka, <laughs> You know that you don't have link into that land. Mm. You don't even have any connection to that land. At all! I wonder how 
you managed to enter into that land for the first time. Mm. Eh? <laughs> oh, Kandu, you are talking as if the land belongs to you. Mm -hmm. That piece of land belongs to me. And I have every legal document to protect my land. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Show us that legal document that makes Obiajolo's land yours. Yes. Go. Go see any kind of fear. Hmm. Show us. I'll fly there. Quick. Okay, Uncle. Ebo Ole, I'll go to Mos. Hmm. Mamro. Mamro to Mos. Let's see a kind of fear. I'm going to do. That's this man. Yeah, tomorrow. And I'm going to be able to have something that is plain. This is the mega document that I have for you. What is the meaning of this? Are you trying to bribe us? You will have more of this only if you stand by my face. <laughs> Do you mean we'll have more of this if we support you? You will have more of it. Hmm. Okay. Mm. You know that piece of land eh, is situated at a very expensive site in the village. Mm. If I sell that land, you are going to have mouth-watering share from the proceeds. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> or, or wait. How then would we know when you will say that land, would you even remember us then? Uh -huh. mm -mm. That's true. Okay, okay. Mm. Okay. I know, man. This is pure business. And in business, only trust and believe is there. Ah, I was. Oh. <laughs> you just coming to your place. I hope on this well. Is uh, Ibeka. Please warn him to stay away from my land. Help me beg him to stay away from my land, please. Obi Ajul, which of the land are you talking about? Mm -hmm. It is the one that is close to the local government secretariat. So many people have approached me that they wanted to buy the land. And I told them, no, my grandfather gave me the land. And I also want to give my children the land. But Ibeka won't let me be. Um, Obi Ajil, <laughs> if it's land close to the market we are, we are talking about. No, the one close to the local government secretary. And I say the, say the same thing. Mm -hmm. That land does not belong to you. Oburuko wa nwe o we pa ke ba it's not your own. I thought you're talking to someone else. It's you I'm talking to. My ears are they deceiving me or something? You had him right. Can I not take that land was sold by your grandfather to Ibeka's father. Wow. And you know it. Onako. Mm -mm. Mamione, what is going on here? What is going on here? Oh, has he bribed you? What? So you stopped us here for you to insult us? Let's go. He has bribed us, as you said. He has bribed us. He has bribed us. What is this? I can't believe this. 
just like that. Hmm. Do you know? Mm -hmm. I thought that man was joking. Until he brought out that huge amount of money and gave to us. Mm -hmm. I can't even remember the last time I touched or saw such amount of money. Ha. Do you know? That money will go a long way in my life and in my family. Also your life. I don't know for you. Mm. Do you know? We are in a hard time for that man to bring out that huge amount of money to give me and you. Ha! That man has been making a lot of money on those land sales. So. But, but, uh, something still beats my mind. What is it? Why is Ibeka selling his lands? His father acquired large portion of land for him. And even when he grew up, he started business and bought some more. Why is he sending all of them now? Hmm. That one is it's not my business. So, hmm. But that man hmm. will sell all the communities because he has been selling people's portion of land. Bam! That's what I'm saying. But I think he has psychological problem. How do you mean? Oh, yeah. The worst part of it is that he refused to marry. He refused to marry, to remarry. And he is selling all his valuable properties and that of his late children. <sighs> hmm? That one is not my business. Yeah. My business is when he sell the land, he gives me my own share. It doesn't concern me. You are born today. Because can I have a call? If you talk, I What more am I living for? The earth has left me. The future has gone far away from me. I wonder which day will be my last. All I met and the ones I made by myself should have been kept as legend to a new generation of me. Aye. But where is the future? Oh God, is it not better to eat? Man, eat. No one will eat if you don't. Just eat. Enjoy yourself. My, you've not even opened your food. And since you came back, you've been moody. I got the greatest shock of my life today. I still can't believe my ears. Okonkwa and uh, Okando testified against you. Why before my very face? Both of them know that Ibeka has no plot of land around the local government secretariat. I still can't believe what triggered them to say all those lies against me. Even while I was there. Hey! Um, Nay, in that case, you have to report it to the king. Uh -huh. So what you must understand is this. If I report to the king, they are still the same people that they will call to testify. That is the problem. He bribed them. Yes. Money is power. Money will make you do things you could not believe you will. That is it. I bribed them. Oh, 
Why have you decided to be so wicked to me, your brother? Eh? Me, your blood brother? I don't understand what you mean. You mean you are having an issue of land as serious as this with someone and you decide not to let me know? Why? <laughs> oh, um, you see, one thing about you is this. You are too much into fetish, you know, things that I don't want to have any affair with you. Obi Ajilu, isn't it obvious that you are making a very big mistake? What if that man decides to take those lands away from you? What will you do? Is it then you will come to inform me? Eh? Uh, yes. And that's when it's the only option. It's alright. When you finally make up your mind to let me know, no problem. I will be ready to assist you. It's alright. Then be ready to bury me if you let them kill me. What kind of a human is this? It's alright. No problem. Oh, Gina, you're up. I'm happy to see you up. I'm happy to see you open your eyes. How are you feeling now? Where is my son? Gina, this is not the time to ask about this. You just have to relax and calm down, please. Jennifer, how is my son? Jennifer, how is my son? Gina, I was told you lost him. But, but don't worry, I believe God will bless you with another child. Okay? Just take things easy, please. Where is my son? Wow! You can now talk. This is wonderful. This is wonderful. How are you? Um, I don't understand what she's talking about. Honey, what is it? Whatever it is, just go ahead and tell me. Okay? Talk to me, please. I'll, 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 I'll do it for you. My son. I want my son. I want to see my child. Um. We. We lost him. But, but, but do not worry, okay? God is going to give us another child. Yes. You're going to be us another child, okay? Jennifer, Jennifer, please, I want to see my son. Okay, babe, come down, okay? My son, stop, Jennifer, please. Jennifer, my son. Gina. My son, Jennifer, give me my come son. Down. Jennifer, my son. You will have another child. My son. Okay, God will give us another no. one. No, oh. Jennifer. Yes, come in. Doctor? Mr. Johnson? My wife opened her eyes and uh, she started talking a few minutes ago. Beautiful. That's good news. But she kept saying, I want to see my child. I want to see my child. What's the meaning of that? Oh, don't worry, Mr. Johnson. That could be, especially the effect of the medications. She will be fine. Doctor? Is she having a kind of mental disorder? Mental disorder? We need to see her. Uh, let's go. Gina, are you out of your mind? I mean, what nonsense are you talking about? Don't act as if you don't know what I'm talking about. 
You know what I am talking about. Do not look me in the eyes and say it. Isn't it obvious I may not be able to conceive again? Can't you see? Posterity is definitely coming for me. Posterity. What are you saying? What are you saying? I don't get it. I want my son back. I can see you've suddenly gone nuts. Yes, you're losing it. You've suddenly gone nuts. Son, just give me my son. My son. Gina. Gina, how are you? Doctor, I am not fine. I want my son back. Oh. Jennifer. Don't worry, stop crying. As long as you stay healthy, you will see your son back. Okay? <laughs> Come on, stop crying. <laughs> my son. My child. My child. It's okay. It's okay. My child. It's alright. My child. Oh, my child. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you going to the bar? Well, I'm going back to my husband's house. I don't understand. Your sister keeps saying that you're with her child. And the doctor said that she's not mentally okay. Here you are wanting to leave without even letting me know. What is really going on? Some things are complicated here that I can't even comprehend. What's going on? I have a family to attend to. So please, if you will excuse me. When you came, you said you've come to take care of your sister for me. Now, what is changing it? Nothing changed. I have family to attend to, like I oh. earlier said. If that's the case, I am going to call your husband to ask him to allow you stay maybe one more week or so. I said I am not staying back. Ah, is that too much to understand? You should be able to take care of your wife. Better still, carry her to our mother. She's still strong and healthy. I am not staying back. I'm going to my husband's house. Take care of your wife. Where is Kinsey? I don't know where he is. You know, he likes to isolate himself. No, you don't know where he is. Two brothers, but you hate one. Tell me why. Seriously, I don't like your manner of parenting. It is so bad. What is your problem? You don't like associating with him. You show him no love. What kind of a father are you? Hey, please, I, I am not in for this now. Did you get what I said? I told you I don't hate anyone. I'm only trying for him to improve. And that is what I'm doing. I don't like what you're saying. What is the problem? Eh? Moreover, you said you'll be back in two weeks' time. What happened? This is very bad of you. You should better change it. I don't like it one bit. You have to show these boys equal love. That's what it takes to be a father. Excuse me. What is going on? I don't understand what's happening. This one, you're back and you're ranting. What is going on?
Field and go play ball. Abati, are you mad? Yeah. No, no, did I not give you a clear instruction that under no circumstances should you allow any of my children go out there to play? Uh, 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 madam, you can be say, in tell me say, in the board, say nobody the full and play for this house. So, based on say, in don't complain, say, in the very board. I can't see a carry and go field where all the other boys they play ball. If you follow them, they play ball. Uh, but can you hear yourself speak? Did you just listen to yourself while talking? Huh? Uh, but please, take me to that field right now. The, the field no far from here. If you want, I, I feel carry you go there. Uh, but please take me to the field. Madam, I, I, I never lock my door. Make I go lock my door. Make I no go lose guard. Boy, the skill. You're a blessing to this boy. I don't tell you. You're a blessing to me again. Um, madam, you're welcome. Madam, madam, why do you tell you off? Ooh, I don't think there is God. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, madam, you're welcome. I, I must confess, this boy is very good. He's very, very good. And uh, I'm so happy having him as a member of my team. He's very good. Uh, but, I want them. <laughs> Um, yeah, good to hear. But, you know, I have a problem with kids playing football. When my brother was much younger, he was a popular footballer. Okay. But then he broke his leg in the field while playing football. And that was the end of his career. So, you see, when I say it, I'm scared, I'm really scared. Um, it will never be his portion. No evil will come near him. Don't even, don't even think of that. Guy is making me proud of, and I'm so proud of him. Mm. You go far. That, that, that's your brother. We break a leg. You know we are shin guard. Kingsley, they we are shin guard. Mom, please, please don't stop me from playing football. Hey, 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 madam, guess what? You why I won't talk, eh? See, for this world where we do so, eh? Everybody where God creates. God, they carry talent to give each person. Now, so it be, eh? my brother. Mm -hmm. this, yes. this boy, where they see so, as they see and so. Now, football, now be your own talent. Exactly. Make we not lose guard the boy, make him go make us proud. Eh? Make we not cut the talent short. Eh? It's Please. like you're seeing what I'm Baby. seeing. Baby, listen. I'm scared. I don't want anything to happen to you. Okay? Please don't stop me from my football career. Don't lose guard again. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I will. You know, this again. Madam, you see this boy, you see so, eh? My to God, God Himself, don't mark his legs. You don't see him. <laughs> boy, you can join, join, join. Your Take team. five. You have not said anything since you came back. What is the problem? 
Huh? Are you okay? Get me pregnant. What? Please. You have to do this for me. Please. I want another child. Please. Oh, babe. Is there anything you're not telling me? Nothing. Nothing. I just I just want another child. I just want it. Please. You have to do this for me, please. But um we sorted this out even before we got married. I told you I needed only two children. I told you that, right? I know. I know, babe. I am ready to fend for him. I am going to fend for him. Please. You, you don't have to put that yourself. Just... Oh, it's okay, babe. It's okay. It's okay, right? Stop crying. If that is what you want, then we'll plan about it. Okay? Thank you. Don't worry yourself. It's okay. Sleep. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Baby. Baby, I sleep. Baby, please. I went to the hospital and was told you here. I don't even know where I am right now. See, Johnson, you're soaking yourself in anxiety, and this is not good for you. See, if you should continue like this, man, you're going to end up falling in depression. My wife said that her sister has a child. Well, the doctor said that my wife is having a slight mental problem. Just a few minutes after my wife said that, my sister packed her things and returned home. Why would she do a thing like that? I mean, I'm sure she hasn't stayed um, up to one week here. Yeah? I think there's something they're not telling me. So did you try asking your wife's sister about it? And the way she left simply means that she doesn't want to talk about it. Oh. Well, when I went to the hospital, I saw your wife. She was looking a bit stronger than before. So I believe she's fine enough to tell us what is going on. But the doctor said... Forget about what the doctor said, man. Huh? We'll just hear from your wife first and we can inquire if what she's saying is true or not. That's the best thing to do. Don't give this guy. Don't give me that one. You know one go to school. Then keep banana. You know you don't know say your school boys there they wait for you since. Come here. I don't want to go to school. Which kind which kind which kind which kind yeah yes smelly talk with that. I hear which you. which kind lose garden be that one. You know one go to school. See what you happen. Why no one go to school? In my school, if you're not intelligent, you'll be treated badly. My teacher always tell my miss to laugh at me. Just because I'm not intelligent. Kingsley, I want you to understand something, eh? You see that thing where your teacher they do? You know me say your teacher no like you. No! Your teacher they do and based on say, it won't make you improve. It won't make you fall learn. It won't make you get better. Your teacher won't make you be champion. In my field, if I don't play well, my coach will personally call me and teach me how to play well. Not tell my mate to laugh at me. Kingsley. School and football are not the same. They're two different things. That's my boy. That's my boy. That's my boy. Kingsley, come. Come. Let me clear you something. Come. Come. You hear what your brother talk? I don't hear him. School and football will not be the same. They're two different things. Eh? I want to make you no mind anything where person they talk. 
I will make you take your education very serious. I will make you be champion, both in the field and in class. Mm -hmm. I will make you take number one position, both in the field and in the class. You see all those nonsense where people always talk, all those people where they lose guard, where they talk say school has come. I know what make you listen to them. Even if you go talk say school has come, make you for go school first. Yeah, them where they say, talk and huh? they, they go school. Uh, they don't go school. And, 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 and why is it important to make you go school? You say, you now will be international footballer. So that if you reach where they go speak English, you go speak well. Yeah. If they give you a contract to sign for Arsenal Football Club, you know, go get Arsenal and go for, for Chelsea or Manchester. Make you for read your contract to wear. Because okay. we no go school, no they have a contract. Okay, ma, I kill myself because of book. Huh? Ma, I kill myself because of book. You don't lose guard. You think so I get your time this way? They go to school. I don't provoke. No, they can't sell it. They go to school. Let's go to school. School back to school. Let's go to school. Go school. School was there, they wait for you. They here, they lose guard. Don't be school. Why uh, Why no go? Now, 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 make I end up like this. You, why you get hope? So I won't be international agent. I know go to read contract. You, why you not go to read? If you understand all that with 10 million pounds, they go come price me and you. 10,000. They... If I'm going to run away, I'm going to run away. You're watching again. Have mercy on me. If I'm going to run away, I'm going to run away. You're watching again. Have mercy on me. I'll get in the morning now. Sorry, sir. Excuse me, sir. Okay. Let me call you back. What, sir? Sir, please. I'm very hungry. And, and I need to eat before I can take my medication. Please, can you help me, sir? Medication? Yes, sir. Ooh. Don't have much, just manage this one. Huh? Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. You should take that drug. Regina. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, she's perfectly okay, though she needs to stay in a little check. Uh, there's no problem about that. I'll be bringing her from time to time. Oh, very well then. Um, I'm just going to gather her files and um, run a little bit check up on her. Then. Okay. Okay. We can go now. No idea. Meaning? I don't understand. 
Doctor, there is a problem. I saw Mrs. Gina entering a taxi before I could even get to her. She has gone. What? Where could she have gone to? I don't know. What incompetence? Just look at yourself. Listen to yourself. I'm sorry, Doctor, but she disguised herself. She has already left before we realized she was the one. I'm sorry. Uh, um, um, Mr. Johnson, I'm so sorry for this negligence. Please, I I'm sure she must be home by now. Just go home. If she's not there, get back to me as quick as possible. Just look at yourself. I'm sorry, doctor. Bridat. Bridat. Stop there by this. Who you be and who you defined? I hope my son is in this house. Which son? I they ask you who you be and what do you find come this place? Are you mad? Is this the first time you see me in this house? This one will not be the first time why they see you for this place. But not the first time why they see you looking like this. So I don't know what will be your mission for this place. If you don't leave my presence now, I will show you that I am a mad woman. I say you don't lose God. It's your fault. Get off. I say you don't lose God. Everybody for this house don't they mad? Nah, eh? The house owner is the lose God. They mad. Even the visitors where they find them come to what they lose God. They mad. See you, eh? How about God? Where make me and you? I see you, eh? How about to God? Where make me and you? I don't mark your face to God. My child. Do you know what nonsense are you talking about? I have come. To take my child! You know, you must be mad. And please, I do not want your problem now. Leave my house, Gina. There is no way I am leaving this house without my child! Gina, what has gotten over you? Are you mad or something? Gina, if you don't want me to send you to coma, leave my house! <laughs> She thinks I am joking! Go in there and give me my child. Else, I will gladly walk up there and take my child! You will do no such thing. What is wrong with you? Why are you acting up? What is it? Watch me. Gina, stop! Gina, what is wrong with you? I just love you. I'm joking. Oh, she thinks I'm joking. Oh, my child. Gina, Gina, stop. 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 Gina, 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 don't do this. Don't do this. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? Huh? There's a very big problem. Oh. I, 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 I hear some kind of shout, some kind of noise inside. What can be the problem? Mummy and Auntie Gina are fighting. Huh? What can be the cause of the fight? Auntie Gina, I saw Auntie Gina. She ran into the house and started shouting. She wants to see her child. Did you see her child? Yeah, party. A party. A party. A party. A party. I don't stay here since. I don't see any child here. Hey. But the way that woman take a body into this compound, eh, I don't sure see. She carry nothing for mine to come here. Please go inside and separate them. Before she wounds her mummy. Before she. You want me to go there so that they will injure me? 
You did not pay for this job. I don't know for him. Oh. They pay me to open gate. Hey, 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 I don't know why I'm passing through all this at this time of my life. I heard she went to fight her sister. What? She insisted that her sister is with her child. A child? Don't you think there might be an item of truth in what she's saying? Item of what? Does it mean that my wife had a child before I met her? Anything is possible. And, and, and she didn't tell me? <sighs> oh. You see, Johnson, when people fall in love, they tend to hide their ugly past just to get things going. Well, let's not conclude yet. I mean, I believe what the doctor said could be the case here. It all of them is unbearable. Look, I understand what you're going through right now, okay? I get it. But you have to calm down. You have to calm down. Like, things happen in life. But you, you just have to, like, they happen to make you stronger. All right? Not all this gets you. Be yourself, man. I know that one day all this world would end. Um, Gina, I do not understand. Are you meaning to tell me that my boys are not twins? Yes. One of them is my child. Gina, please shut up. You're talking rubbish. You? Are the one talking rubbish. There is no way I am going to live here without my child. Hey, 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 hey. It's okay. Right? Um, you both do not need to fight over this. I spoke to your husband. Promised to come tomorrow. Okay? We'll settle this amicably. There is nothing to settle. Just give me my child. That's all. And that's all! It's simple! One minute. That's all! Give me my child, then I leave. I want my child. He's my boy, he's my, he's my son. I carried him here for nine months. Just give him to me, then I leave. I'm, I'm, I'm confused. Eh? I, I, I'm confused. I am the most confused person in this planet Earth. What is going on? Uh, oh, babe. The, 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 the doctor confirmed that my sister is a mental patient. She's been acting all weird since the loss of her baby. Well, she doesn't look it, eh? Babe, are you not trying to believe her or what? Not really, just that... Uh, why would she say such a thing right in my presence? Babe, she's been acting all weird since she lost her child. Babe, come on. Were you not here when her husband called to, to, to confirm that they've been looking for her all over the place? Oh yes, he did. He even said that um, she disguised herself and left the hospital. Hey, hey. that is it. Hey? I'm not, I don't know, I'm confused. I don't know what is going on. Hey, I'm babe. really confused. Say, you don't have to be, okay? 
Do you even think I'm happy? Do you think I'm happy seeing my sister this way? My sister has gone nuts. And you know, in a situation like this, she's, she's capable of saying anything. Anything at all. She doesn't have a sanity intact. Just calm down, please. Okay? It's okay. Now I know why dad doesn't like me. What do you mean by that? I'm not his son. Why will you say it's him like that? So you believe aunt? Yes. Why won't I believe her? I've been thinking about this before now. If dad is my biological father, he won't hate me so much. I told you nobody hates you. You don't need to convince me. All I want to know now is who my biological father is. Since dad is not your biological father, mom is not your biological mother too. That's a lie. She is my mother. Someone is confused here. Prove me wrong. She will not even let us sleep. Hey, I'm sorry for the stress, but you know she's my only sister. I know. Is she being serious? I mean, how could such a thing happen to a lovely lady like her? I think um, this needs some serious attention. We need to do something about it. Something like what? Maybe call Prophet Malachi. He will assist her and tell her what the problem is. Babe, all my sister needs right now is a medical treatment. Maybe after that, I can take her to Prophet Malaki. But for now, it's medical care. No, it's okay. It's fine. Then can you please talk to her? She's your sister. Tell her that I want to sleep. Sure. Right. Please. Sorry for the stress. I'll be right back. Come to give him to me. Just sit down, okay? Please give me my child. I know. Sit down, please. Give me my child. Sit down. <laughs> Gina, you are my lovely sister, and I love you so much. But you don't want to give me my child. Gina, please calm down. You know I will give you anything you ask of me. <laughs> I can't even give you the boys. They are your children. Oh, are you serious? Yes. Yes, Gina. 
everything that belongs to me belongs to you. Remember how we used to be. Remember how we started from the village. How we shared everything together. Remember how we toyed through the storms in the city. Have you forgotten how we used to be? The bond we shared. Gina, you are not just my sister. You are like a best friend to me. Everything I want is in you as a sister and as a friend. And that kept me wondering, why have you come here to fight me and torment me and destroy my home? Why? Why have you come here to mess me up? Why? Jennifer. I am sorry. I, I, I don't know what came over me. I don't, I don't know what came over me. Gina, anything you want me to do, just tell me. I will do it for you, please. I've been feeling guilty. It's like I'm being hunted. Hunted? What is haunting you? you? You can share with me. I am your sister, okay? Jennifer, I, I, I want you to call Mama and Papa. I want them to come tomorrow. I have a confession to make. A confession? A confession about what? About what Mama made me do. And about the boys. What boys are you talking about, Gina? Jennifer. If I don't say this, my soul will not know peace. I, I, I have to say it. I, I, my, my, my soul is... I am haunted! Oh, Gina, please shut up. Jennifer, so. please, I, I want to see Mama and Papa here tomorrow. I want, I want to set my soul free. I can't keep this. It's killing me inside. I, I, I need to set my soul free. Gina, please shut up. What is it? Look, Gina, I am not going to call anybody. You just have to sleep. Gina, do you want to put me into trouble? You have to call them. You have to call them because I need to tell them this. I can't, I can't. I don't even know what sleep is. I have not been sleeping in the past month, Jennifer. I don't know what sleep is. I need to say this so that I can be free. I have to say this, Jennifer. You have to call them. You just have to call them because I, I'm losing it. I have been losing it. I need to, I need to talk to someone. Please just call them for me, please. I can't sleep. I can't sleep. I can't please. sleep. Jennifer, I haven't been sleeping. Relax yourself I haven't been sleeping. and sleep. Just I have a hot bath and sleep. No, I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. I Hello, sir. Good evening. So to you, Eric, how are you? Sir, please, all is not well. What, what kind of problem? Um, sir, please, can I see you, you and your wife in my house tomorrow, if possible? Okay, but I hope no one is dead. Not really, but there is something important I would want us to discuss. And I would want you people to come tomorrow, please. It's very important. Uh, just take it easy until we come tomorrow, okay? It's fine, sir. Thank you so much, sir. All right, good night. I'll wait you tomorrow. Please don't fail. Thank you.
Who was that? Eric. Our in-law. Eric. Yeah, he said we should uh, come to town tomorrow morning. Is there any problem? Mm -hmm. Or is he having problem with Jennifer? He didn't say, but it, it, it sounded urgent somehow. But the thing is that no one is ill anyway. It's okay. Tomorrow we'll find out the reason he called. We'll, we'll leave in the morning. Oh, honey, we can now sleep. I've taken her to the visitor's room. And what is it that um, she wants to say about my kids? Um, baby, please, come on. Let's sleep, okay? We've had enough for tonight. Jennifer, is that something you're hiding from me? Uh, baby, why are you sounding like this now? Eh? Oh, I don't know how I'm sounding, but... Um, <sighs> I just pray that it's not what I'm thinking. I just pray that my mind is telling me lies. Because this thing is no longer sounding for me. Babe, please. Let's just try and have some rest. It's late already, okay? Everything is fine. Let's sleep. Could it be that we are not brothers? Stop saying that. You are my brother and my twin. But what if Auntie is right? I think I look more like her. That is a lie. Look at me, you look like me. Look at other twins. They are always identical, but we are not identical. The way that treats me. I have no reason to doubt Auntie. Kinsley, I love you so much. I know you don't like me. I'm afraid of losing you. And I don't want to lose you. Please be my brother. I'm angry with you. You make dad hate me. <sighs> you keep saying that. And I've told you this several times. Nobody hates you. Everybody hates me and you too. I do not hate you. You hate me. Justin, I couldn't sleep last night. I'm sorry about that, man. Do you mean that um, your wife never told you she has a child? Uh, no, no. All these things started since her last pregnancy. And she never said a thing like this before. Do you think there is truth in what she's saying? Uh, the doctor says she could be having some mental complications because of the trauma she went through during her childbirth. I just hope this is not the truth. I just hope this is a lie. Um, your wife should be able to tell you if one of the boys is not yours. Johnson, I'm confused. I don't even know what I'm thinking now. I'm confused. I'm confused. <sighs> if, if, if this happens to be true, then I've been living in lies all this while.
Eric, what is the problem? I couldn't sleep last night. What could the problem be? Gordon, please, I want my wife to come back before we proceed. She went out and she will soon be back. It's all right. Mama, Papa, what are you both doing here? Um, please, come and sit down. I overheard you and your sister discussing and she said she has a confession to make before your father and your mother. Reason I brought them so that we could hear from her. Oh, please. So why didn't you tell me before inviting my parents over? Anyway, we are here now. Regina, I said you have a confession to make. Can we hear you now? Papa. Everything started when you were in prison in Kenya. Jennifer and I we were left with Mama alone in the village. Um, Gina, come on, eh? Like, this is not the best time to tell this kind of story. How parents just arrived. Come on. Jennifer, we all are family now. And I don't think there is anyone here who does not have to hear this story. Have peace of mind. <laughs> Papa. Better go there, better. Paletti, even more young boys. <laughs> it shock you. Anyway, I'm going out now. I'm a competitor. Mama, you seriously going to go out dressed like this? Gina. Jennifer. Leave Mama alone. It is obvious she's not ready to change anytime soon. 
Gina, our mother, has completely turned into something else. What is wrong with that woman? I'm short of words. You know, Mama taught us decency. I keep wondering why she turned the opposite of what she taught us. Gina, this woman is disgracing us. And I am not going to stay in this house and watch this display of humiliation coming from our mother. I am leaving this house. Yes, I am going to my husband's house. I can't watch this. Ah, what kind of a mother is this? Ah. Jennifer, you're not serious, are you? Please don't leave me. Gina. I don't want to stay here alone with Mama. Ah, so what do you want me to do? I suggest you come with me. Mama's behavior is becoming so unbearable. I, I can't face the shame. The humiliation is too much. Jennifer, I, 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 I can't come to the city with you. I want to stay here in the village until Papa returns. Uh, I know you want to stay back because Azuka has promised to marry you. But just pray he does that fast. Because staying with Mama in this village is as good as staying in hell. Seriously, come with me. Come with me, oh. This woman will mess your life up. Jennifer. You're really going? After Jennifer left the village, Mama started pushing me into following other men. What? Joako, you mean you do this to your children? I I hope you didn't succumb to that. <sighs> she tried so hard. But I refused to follow any of the men she tried pushing me into. <sighs> then, she started punishing me with hunger and many other things. There is no food in this house. Mm. Not even a penny mm. to buy anything. Mm. Yet you have money to buy chicken and drinks. What kind of a mother are you? Huh? Oh, you want me to kill myself because of family problem? But no. <laughs> I will never try it. I will keep on enjoying myself now that I am still looking young and fresh. Even though 
I am the only lady that will be old without growing old. My name is Jai. What I go? <laughs> what kind of a mother are you? You don't care if your children eat or not. All you care about is to have fun and just drink and eat anyhow. Just enjoying your life alone. Mm -hmm. That is it. Enjoyment is the order of the day. You that is not enjoying, that is why your life still remains the same. You still think you are a small baby. Tata, Obelenwa, they will run and Come and suck breast. Mama, what you are doing to me is not good. God in heaven is watching you. Go out there and meet that good for nothing useless man, Azoka. You call your boyfriend. He has no penny. Shishi! Yet he keeps telling you that he will marry you. And Abaka Lowan. Is it better for me to go and be with all these men that just want to sleep with me and have their way? Is it better? No. Oh. Is it not better? At least if you sleep with them, they will give you money. You give them what they want, they give you what you want. That is what we call using what you have to get what you want. Uh huh. It's so you want me to leave a man that wants to marry me to be with all these other men? <sighs> Mama, I am so disappointed in you. It's better for yeah, 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 yeah. It's better for you to be disappointed on him. Look, let me tell you, from today, eh? No more food for you in this house. You will see me eat, oh, just like God told Moses in the Bible. With your eyes you shall see the promised land, but your leg will not enter inside it. You will use your eyes to see what I will be eating. I will allow you to perceive the aroma <laughs> and so that you know how palatable the soup and the food is. Your tongue will not taste it. What is it? What is wrong with you? His sickness is getting serious. Please, I need money to buy medicine. Kima, I thought we were done with the issue of you asking me for money every time. Eh? I've told you several times that you've got all it takes to make real money. You can even give me. Eh? Mama, please. Can I get some money to buy medicine? Nikono. Jenna, I don't have money, that is the fact. I don't have any money to give to you. I have told you what to do to make money. But it's difficult for you to do. What you don't find difficult is asking me for money. Let me tell you. Even if I have the money, I will not give it to you. Go out there and make money. Make money and give to me your mother. Eh? I honestly doubt you are my mother. But don't worry, very soon I will get married and leave this house for you. <laughs> Gina, get married and forget about leaving the house for me. You have to go and make money and give to me your mother, not the other way around. Azuka, what are you doing? I'm sure you're not blind. As you can see, oh, with the love of my life, my baby. Okay. But you said you would soon come to see my people. Ah, I've not forgotten. 
I know I say that. I said that. But let me tell you, that's the worst thing I've ever said. Do you think anyone, any right-thinking man will want to get married to any girl from your family? Or, 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 or do you want me to be a son-in-law to Joak? Never. I will not. I found love. Mm -hmm. love. Can, can you see that? Please don't do this to me. Hey, please. Stay away from my man. You heard him clearly. He doesn't want you, Biko. Please. Baby. That's my baby. Hmm. You heard that? My baby just said it. Please. My baby just said it. My Please. Love. Don't touch him. Gosh. Please, don't touch him. See that? Oh, my baby. See that. Why is she looking so sort of? Oh, I can take care of her. I can take care of her. Just... Hello, lady. Why is this beautiful damsel looking so cool? What is wrong? Hey, baby. Uh, please talk to me now. What is it? I can take care of you. Ah. Talk to me, baby. What a pretty. Lekwenu. Hey! Lekwenu. This one is succulent pumpkins. Hey! I will get her. <clears throat> I will get her. I must. Hey! If I don't chop this in this town. Listen to me, woman. This family is highly respected in this village. So stop dragging a prestigious name into the mud. Are you by chance talking to me or referring to me? What do you have? Nothing. Ever since you were born into this art, what have you won? Nothing. Then tell me, what prestige are you talking about? By the way, who gave you the right, the impetus, the audacity to talk to me like this. Anyway, I am not here to banter words with you. You either leave us or change this rotten lifestyle of yours. Yes. If anyone should leave this house, it has to be you. Because this is my husband's house. I have every right to do whatever I want in this house. Yes. So what is your problem? It's a lie. Your evil behavior is affecting us all. You either change your lifestyle or I make sure I force you out of this compound before your husband returns. Yes. Husband or whatever you call yourself. Huh? Let me tell you. Let me make it clear to you. One million of you put together in one cannot do anything to me. Do you hear me? You cannot do anything to me. It's all right. Change your lifestyle or I'll push you out of this compound. Which lifestyle? What have you ever... What do you have? This house is my husband's house. I can do anything I want. Huh? Just imagine. Eh? You see me? You're talking to me anyhow. This house is my husband's house. What do I do? I need to leave this village. I need to start making efforts to add value to my life. I have lived like a nobody for so long. Even if I don't have wings, 
I need to borrow and fly to my destiny before I get wasted here in this village. Madam, I want to go out now and may not come back today. So you take care of the house. The poet, I became so depressed. Why didn't you leave the village then? I mean, I was alone in this house. That actually came to my mind. To leave the village. But I had no money. I begged Mama to give me money. I begged Mama. Mama, I begged you. But she refused. She refused to give me money. I begged everyone I knew, but nobody helped me. Nobody gave me a dime. I think I should be the one to hide my face in shame. I knowingly brought a rotten firewood to my house. Papa, Papa, please allow Gina to continue with her story, please. My dear, go on, continue. It, I made the worst mistake of my life. Baby, I will stand by you forever. You can take my breath away. <laughs> but uh, it's good to make money. Cool money. I want to go to the city. Eh? To the city? Oh, that's a great idea. Thank God you've come back to your senses. I know you will now want to do what I asked you to do in a professional way. But don't forget one thing. To get something for me while coming back. Hmm? <laughs> That's a good one. Hey, please. I need transport money. I, I don't know if you can help me with. I'll give you back once I get there. Ah. Uh. You'll give it back to me. Uh, um, like, how much are we talking about here? Anything. Any amount. Any amount is no amount. Just tell me how much. I think it's 1,000 or 1, 5. I'll manage. Uh, 1,000 or 1, 5. That's a small money. Uh, are you sure it will take you to the city? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm sure this will do. Mm? You can tell. Hey, thank you, ah, Mama. Ah, ah. You, even, you even stretched your hand to collect this. Eh? Huh. I will not give you shishi from this money. Not even one naira. Men are out there ready to give you any amount you want just for you to accept to be their friend. You are not. What is the, the big deal there? Give them what they want and get you what you want. A job. You only take pleasure in asking me to give you money. Mama, give me 1,000 naira. 
Mama, give me 2,000 naira. Manyegi. You have all the text to make money. Any amount you want. Money from car. One naira. Manyegi. Are you sure you're my mother? Because my mother will not treat me like this. I'm sure about that. <laughs> Who is talking about being a mother here or not? Do what I asked you to do. Ah, I'm not going to I'm back and told. I'm going to you. Just drink small. Hmm? <laughs> mm. This is dry season. No work in this village now. What will I do with my life? Baby, how are you? I'm fine. Which direction are you heading to? I'm going to the market. Oh, I think I'm going your direction. Can I drop you off there? Come on. Hello, baby. Just enter the car. Baby. I can give you anything. How much do you want that will not be a chicken feed to me? Just say it and you will have it. <laughs> do you know what they call me in the city? Ojego Emogo. <laughs> My angel, just say what you want and I will give it to you. You are not talking to me. Or you think I'm not serious? Okay, let me first give you money so that you know how serious I am. My baby. You are just an angel. As soon as you can make me feel good, you will get whatever you want. You are not talking. Are you not happy with me? Eh? Hey, baby, I hope you are coming tomorrow. Hey! One car, talk one Baby, you are so sweet. I feel good. return to this land again. I'll go to the city, focus on building a better life for myself. I am so ashamed of myself right now. But life has to go on. This will be the very last time I will live my life at the mercy of any. I love you. Won't you marry me? Marry me. I... Ah, Gina, where are you going to? None of your concern. Eh? Come, come, come. Do you want to live only me in this house? Give me a lap major. God, God will pay you back for everything you did to my sister and I. My joy is that my brother does not stay in this village. Only God knows what you have turned into. Ah, 
God knows I did no wrong to you. I only gave you advice as a good mother should give to her loving child. Yes. Did you just call God's name? Did you call God's name? God forbid. God forbid. You can never be my mother. Eh? You are too dirty to be a mother. Gina, did you say that to me? Yes! I said it! I said it. People like you are not worthy to have a womb. Because you're not even... You shouldn't be, you shouldn't be called a mother. You shouldn't. Anyway. We've left here for you. Feel free to turn it into a motel or anything. Bring anybody in. Anything you want to this place. We've left it for you. Stay here alone. But you will never ever be my mother. You can be anything but not my mother. Gina, we let you be that dead woman you want to be, but you can never be my mother. Gina! Hey! She said I'm dead. Who did ya? Come inside. My sister in. Uh, she done inside. I suffered. I suffered in the village. <laughs> My husband left for Canada before you arrived yesterday. Oh. I know. But don't worry, he'll be back soon. So tell me, how is the village? Village girl. My mouth cannot tell what I'm going to This was hard. This is lost. I cursed the day I was conceived in just the whole world of ours. Hmm. It's really quite unfortunate. Because Mama was never like this. Mama changed the moment she heard that Papa has been arrested and sent to jail in Kenya. Maybe she thinks Papa is going to die there. I can bet she's not in Because a woman that has my kind of blood running through her veins will not behave the way she's behaving. I will never call her mother again. Never. You know, children are born in the hands of those they don't even know and they call them parents. The word parents comes in a different package. Some could be good to their children while others... Mama is the worst parent in the history of man. You mean that useless Chiffy Baker blackmailed you to sleep with you before he gave you money? That was why when I got here. I worked so hard. I worked tirelessly. I made so much money once after I got here. Then I started noticing some changes in my body. 
Jenny Foster is in the same exact changes in her body too. Both pregnant. How come? You're as confused as you are. I... You're confused. Gina, my husband got me pregnant before traveling. But you, you are not married. And you know what it means to get pregnant out of wedlock. Hey! What do I do now? What do you do? Who is responsible? Have you tried letting him know? I don't want to have anything whatsoever to do with him. You don't want to have anything to do with him? Why then did you go to him in the first place? Well... He was the one that gave me money with which I came here. And I do not want to ever set my eyes on him forever. Well, I hope you're not thinking of aborting that baby. Baby, I'm... <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh. Wow. I can't believe I'm a proud father of two. Mm -hmm. Two boys. So tell me, what do you want me to do for you? Let me tell you how to do it now. Okay. Mm. I think um, I want you to get me a bigger car. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Which of the model do you want? Any one, baby. Consider it done. Consider it done. SUV. Mm. <laughs> hey, my baby. Mm. Thank you so much. Thank you. Mm. I love you. Mm. I can't wait to carry my boys. <laughs> <laughs> hold on, hold on. Let me call someone. Is it um, SUV, right? <laughs> I'm getting you SUV right away. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. So I've been living in lies all this while, right? Eh? My pains. I will never forgive you. I will never forgive you for leading me into this trouble. Never. Please, my daughters. Please forgive me. Please. After, after those words you said to me, when you were leaving the village. Believe me, I I saw the need to fix my life. <laughs> I am now a changed person. <laughs> I have changed. Please. <laughs> Mama, I regret being your daughter. And you, Gina. Gina, everything 
did I did I did it for you I did it just for you to be happy to save you the shame of being called single mother and now what did I get in return destruction destroying my family what is your gain tell me what is your gain you want to clear your useless conscience I hope you'll be happy to see my husband send me packing. <sighs> Jennifer. My intention is not to hurt anybody. I just I just wanted to, to free my conscience. Oh, please go to hell! Go to hell without your stupid conscience! Just, 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 just go to hell. You have destroyed everything I've worked for. You have destroyed my family, my life, everything. Just go to hell. I need to hurt you. Why should I? Why should I? Why this from you? Why this from you? Shut up! So you have the courts to call me honey, right? You are evil, Jennifer. You are evil. After all I've done for you and your family. I'm so sorry. I, I just wanted to save my sister the shame of being a single mother. And you didn't care how I would feel about it? Is that how unimportant I am to you? No, no, I swear no. Please, I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to hurt you. Please, please, me. Hey, 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 stop it. Stop it. I didn't know you would do this to me. I wouldn't believe that you would do this to me. Eh? I would swear that you wouldn't do such a thing to me, Jennifer. You are evil! Babe, please. I, I, I already took the child as my... Even before he was born. And that was why it was so easy. Hey, stop it! I said stop it! Stop this nonsense you're talking about before I lose it. I don't need all this you're painting. Do not even justify this your evil act. Which of the child is mine? And Sammy, which of the child is mine? Please. Do you want me to go physical with you? Jennifer, which of the child is mine? I said, which of the child is mine? Kisley! Kisley! What? What? What is going on? What is going on?
me in the eye. You have become the termite intending to my life. I am coming back for you. I must vacate that land before I return. You know, I'm so disappointed at you. You said you love me. I believed you. I do love you, honey. I do. I wish you do. Then please, I would like to let you all know that I'm not letting any of my children out of this house. None of my children will go with any of you, and I'm serious about it. Please, your time is up. You can go now. I am not living here without my child. I, I, I can't live here without my child. My child! I can't leave here without my child! Look, I'm not out for this drama. I'm not out for this drama. You don't understand. I, I can't leave here without my child. It's not possible. My child, me, me, my child. Mom. I am not going anywhere with anybody. Canceling here. It's my twin brother. I don't do any of that too. I know. I know, my child. I know, Benjamin. You are not going anywhere with anybody. And I will not let anyone take you away from me, okay? But you thought that, that I am not his son. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you have to hear that, okay? I, I, I just wish you can understand, bro. I'm sorry, please. I wish. I wish that he's not my father. Kinsley, yes. how would you say it in like that? I wish I'm the one that was not his son. Kinsley, this could have been a good opportunity to stay away from him. Come here. Listen. Your father loves you, okay? 
But you don't have to say something like this. Well, he has no choice than to take me. If I was not his son, he would have happily sent me away. Oh. Kesley, your daddy loves you so much. Okay? He only cautions you because he wants you to be better. He wants you to be a good boy. I wish I was not his son. I wish I was not his son. Kesley, shut up. Shut up. You don't have to take your daddy's caution for hatred. He only wants you to be better. I can't believe this. Huh? I mean, why would a woman hide such a thing from her husband? I couldn't believe my ears. I, and I wouldn't believe it if I... If I ever heard it from another person. This is really serious. This is very, very serious. No one will say that Robert Barry is going to pass. No, I am not going to bury this. I, I am not going to bury it at all. I loved her with all my heart. I stood by her when she was passing through the pains of bearing me a child. But now that I find out that she's living in lies, I am not going to take it. I understand the way you feel right now, okay? I get it. I'm a man also. But see, you have to calm down. You have to take things easy with hey, yourself. Come on, man. What are you talking about? Huh? If you find yourself with this kind of woman, if you wear my shoes, what are you going to do? Look, Johnson. If I tell you what I am going to do if I was in your shoe, you wouldn't believe me. Because we do not reason the same way. The only advice I would give to you is that you should not jump into conclusions. Things can still be fixed. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. You didn't get this one right. Not at all. There is nothing to fix about this. She must go back to her father's house. Yes. Oh, come on, man. Come on. You don't understand. You don't understand. Oh. No wonder people were just staring at me just staring at me when I came back in a manner that I didn't understand. You brought shame to my family. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So why did you do that? I have no other option. There was no other way to put food on our table. So for 10 years, you did that under my roof? I'm sorry to say yes. I'm sorry. How careless you are being. Oh. It's all my fault. Yes. I've been such an imbecile all this while. Not an imbecile. You are not. Isn't it obvious? No, tell me. Isn't it obvious that I have been an imbecile all the while? That you lived 
such a dirty life under my roof. You, you live a solitary kind of life. You hated people telling you what you did not see. It's all my fault. It's entirely my fault, the kind of life I chose for myself. If you knew you didn't love me, why, why didn't you just leave me to live my life in peace? I can't believe you are saying this. I can't just accept it that you are the one saying this. After damaging my womb, who do you expect me to cut? So you are still punishing me for what I did to you. I was having grief in my heart. But when Gina said those words to me before leaving the village 10 years ago, I knew how bad I have been. And I decided to change. That was why I keep on saying, I am sorry. And I mean it. I changed. Draco. For 30 good years. That is three decades. You see, kept that grief in your heart after I begged you. Woman, you really do have a heart. I really do have a heart. Is that what you said? My womb was harvested from me, just like a cassava is harvested from the sun. Is that forgettable? Living my entire life knowing that I would be fruitless? Answer me. Is it forgettable? Well, I thought you forgave me. That was why I did not poison you. That was the reason I did not pay you back. Getting married to you was a sort of fulfillment because I was worried after the unholy incident that no man could marry me. But my grief and pain made it impossible for me to focus as a wife. But 10 years after Gina left the village, I found peace of mind for the first time after the incident. And then, I decided to forgive you completely and took what happened to me as my fate. I'm sorry for what? I'm sorry for making you go through all this, please. I'm sorry. I forgive you. Ibeka, so 
you, 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 you had to go to sleep with my daughter and got her pregnant. Hey, this is the height of irresponsibility. And we must end it today. Come out with your magic. Let us do it man to man. Hey, are you aware well at all? I thought you are not at all married. It has been more than 10 years. I still sad. Oh, you, oh, 10 years ago. So you have forgotten so soon, eh? You have forgotten so soon what you did to my daughter. Come out now. I said, come out. Let me remind you with my, with my magic. No problem. I will come back for you. I will come back for you. I am coming back for you. Huh? Okay, which I will come over. Bet, eh? God, if what this man is saying is truth, Almighty God, thank you. Thank you. So I have a son, and I'm bewildering. Eh? I have a son somewhere. God, thank you. Thank you. Let me walk with you. Oh, with you. This man almost killed me. call me that name again. Did you hear what I said? I said, don't call me that name again. We live in the same house, sleep on the same bed, and you had the gods to hide the true identity of my children from me? Honey, please. Hey, 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 stop it. We can amend this together, please. How are we going to amend it? Tell me, I should allow them to take my child, my lovely child, away from me? Is that what you're trying to insinuate? That must be a joke of the year because I'm not going to do that. Did you hear what I said? Benjamin will leave this house when I'm dead. Mini, please. We can actually settle this without causing problem. Please. Jennifer, whatever your name is, I'm done with you. Don't stand on my way because you will receive it hot from me. Did you hear what I said? I'm yet to decide your fate in my house. Oh yes, I'm yet to decide if you are going to continue being my wife living in the same house with me or go back to your father's house. Please, it hasn't gotten to that. Please. You heard me loud and clear. I carried you in this womb for nine months. You suckled this breast for six months. You are not my mother, you are lying. You can ask your auntie Jennifer, she will tell you. She's my mother, you're the one that is my aunt. Stop causing problems for my mother, you're causing problems with my family's mom. Lisa, please follow me, let me take you where you belong, you don't belong here. Mom! Please come with me. Mom! Did you hear that? Did you hear that? You and your family, you are trying so hard to pull out the madness in me. And I will show you guys how I, how I am. I will show you. Hey, 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 get, 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 get back. Leave my house. Do you hear what I said? I said, leave my house. Please. Oh, we have sex with this together. I do not want to hurt you. I don't Mom. want to be hard on you, please. Mom! 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 Mom!
Leave my house! Leave my house! Babe, please, take leave it easy. Now. Take it easy. Hey, hey, shut up! Shut up, except you will leave before her. Get out of my house. 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 Get out of my Give me my son. 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 I do not want to see her anywhere close to this house again. Did you hear what I said? Yes, Oga. Give me my If I see her anywhere close to this house, I will burn you alive and I'm serious about it. Give me my son, Daddy. <laughs> Make you know they lose guard for that gate. Be at the one, be at this girl. Nah, eh? Make you know they lose guard for that gate, Oyster. Give me my son. Don't make noise for our gate. You know they lose guard. Give me my son. Make you know they make noise for our gate. Make you know they lose guard. Taka taka sana njinga wewe. What are you doing here? What? Please. Please, and I'm so sorry. I'm sorry for not telling you about that. You know, I know you're sorry, but the thing is that I am done with this marriage. Yes. You have to go in there, pack your things, and leave my house. Are you being serious right now? You, you, you want me to go and pack your things for you so you leave my house, right? Johnson, you mean to tell me that it is just my bag I owe to you in this marriage? The fact remains that I cannot live with you anymore under this roof. Huh? I cannot trust you with anything again. But I trusted you, Johnson. I trusted you when I brought out 30 million naira when we wanted to buy this house. I trusted you when your business crashed and I gave you 20 million naira to start again. You look me in the eye and tell me to go pack my things and leave your house. You're not being serious. Oh, for real? Since you don't want to leave my house, get ready to see my second wife. Wait for it. What kind of rubbish are you talking about? No, tell me. Come, Ibeka, you are pushing me to commit suicide. And I will not regret it if I if I had to do it. Obi Ajilu. Jiri Wanyo. Biko. Please take it easy. Obi Angelo, please forgive me. I have come to give you back everything that I have taken from you. Can you find a place in your heart to forgive me? You have come to return everything you are taking from me. If it, even if you did not come to return them, I know very well that I would have gotten them myself. That's not an issue at all. Obi Angelo, for 20 years now, I've been battling cancer. Just last week, the third talk told me that I have less than a month to live. 
Look at him. He's trying to use emotional strategy on me. You think I am a child or I'm a woman that you can just deceive like that? Okay. This is my head file. You all know when I lost my wife in an auto crash. I never wanted to marry another woman because I never wanted to bring in a woman that will maltreat my son. But when I receive the ugly news of the death of my son, everything about my life changed. My head situation, my condition. Even when I wanted to bring another woman in my life, I was told that I cannot even impregnate a woman. That was when I became frustrated. You all know me. You know my condition before now. I never bother anybody. Though I used to think in my heart that it was my innocent lifestyle that is causing me problems. That was reason I started misbehaving, causing problems here and then. That was wrong. That is the same mistake most people make. Trying to solve problems with problems. You should have made some spiritual inquiries, at least to find out why you were facing those problems and seek the solution to your problems. As a man, my brother, I was ignorant of her spiritual inquiries. I was never raised to believe in spiritualities. That is why people suffer. The spiritual controls the physical. At least you can see how far you have suffered on this earth. You can see for yourself. Um, wait. Since um, you said you are not fertile, does that mean you're not the one that impregnated my daughter? That is why I'm here. Some years after my encounter with Gina, my head became so bad. It was after then, the doctor told me that I am no more fertile. This is very serious, if you ask me. No one would know you were passing through these kind of problems. So terrible. Please, I want you to do me a favor. Can I set my eyes on him for the last time before I leave the world? I know I cannot have him for myself. I might not even be able to correct the wrongs I have done. But please, permit me to see him for the last time before I take my last breath. Well, if it's something that I can do, why not? I'll do it. And I can tell you that it's so brilliant to the ball. Oh, really? You're welcome. I'm actually here to tell you that it's among the keys that we have selected to represent this country in the under 14 championship in South Africa. Oh, really? Exactly. Uh, 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 oh, I'm so surprised. My own Kingsley. Exactly. Wow, I didn't know he can play that well. So, is that good in football? It's very good. And, uh, that's why I've come to beg for your permission. Okay. 
you have you have whatever you need i, I will support eh? so you're good in football eh? i give that a high five i know why you're surprised you didn't believe that anything good can come out of me um um my son it's not that okay I was just trying to build you so that you would become a better person. You believed in Benjamin because he was intelligent. If not Apathy that discovered this talent in me, and mom that supported me, and stood by me, you would have left me to waste. Don't say that, okay? Don't say that. I love you as my son. I love you so much. You know that, right? So as a father, I will not spare the rod so that I won't spoil you. That's because you found out that Benjamin is not your son. Dad, you hated me. Because I was not intelligent in school. Hey, my son, can, can, you, can you come back? I'm sorry, okay? You see? Kinsley. Currently, he's the best striker from this state that was picked no. to wow. represent uh, our country, South Africa. Wow. 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 Okay. Wow. I didn't know he can play that well. I didn't know at all. Kensley is very intelligent. He can play very well. Hmm. And, uh, I think what happened earlier is one of the reasons I'm here to see you. You see, Kinsley cries every day when he comes to the training. He complains that his dad hates him. <laughs> he always complains. He's not, he's not good at all whenever I see him on the training ground. So he's the one of the reasons I'm here to see you. Well, the truth is that I didn't hate him. I was only building him to become a better person. I was only molding him as my son because I found out that he's dull, so I needed him to to be serious in his academics. But uh, some things that I've seen uh, makes it look like you are favoring one more than the other. Well, like I said, it was just in a bid to make him better. Mr. Eric, I must tell you that this is a problem that most families are facing now. Making a child uh, to be jealous of his brother or other siblings will never make he or she better. Rather, it will make them to be having issues and to bring damages on themselves. So, if you ask me, I will tell you to show equal love to your children. And, uh, can I ask you something? Okay. Do you notice that uh, Kensley doesn't like Benjamin at all? Yes, I do, but I, 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 I felt it's just, um, he's just being childish. Kensley is never being childish. You see, Kensley will grow up with that hatred. So you better do something fast. And uh, do you also notice that uh, Kensley hurts you? Oh yeah, yeah. But as a kid, I know that he will grow up to know that I mean well for him. Keep on showing him more love, and the thought of the hatred will be out of him. It's fine. It's fine. Thank you so much. I appreciate. It. So what do I offer you? Anything. Okay. Um. Because <laughs> this life is full of mystery. No one knows tomorrow at all. I have always believed in my twin brother. Wait. 
always say twin brothers. Yes, we are. I have registered it deep, deep in my mind that you are my twin brother and nobody can change that. But you're the one that makes father hate me. I've told you so many times, nobody hates you, my twin brother. Really? My twin brother. <laughs> Wait, you might. <laughs> Brother. Take fight. <laughs> Take your own. <laughs> hey. Well, I've been telling you before, see, for this life, all your dreams, they valid. See, everything we want be for this life, they possible. If you know they believe me, <laughs> see, you can be anything where you want be, including champion. If you want be champion, if you know believe me, eh? eh? No, I didn't. Okay. Now, you believe me, say everything there possible, have you no belief? Yes, I believe you, and I will never forget you for what you have done for me. That's me now, is you know me, Abati. Mwa, Abati in Siebe. No, <laughs> don't be short. Um, if I tell you something about this, your twin brother here, mm. so will keep your face like that. If I, if I tell you something about your twin brother, you could believe him, have you no go believe. I will not believe. No, nah, eh. No, nah, eh. And this thing where they do like this. I be that thing why they always say a person they lose guard. I know but they lose guard. You will be my guy. You will be jovial guy. You might need the jovial. At this point, you can't lose guard. Eh? I want to tell you something. Your twin brother here loves you. <sighs> he too love you. He doesn't love me. Eh? And he's not my twin brother. At least, we all know the truth now. He's not my twin brother. Don't they lose God again? Not my twin brother. Don't they lose God again? There's something why I won't clear give you. Eh? For this life where they see so. Anybody will you accept from the bottom of your heart, seeing I your brother. <laughs> Even if now another mama born the person, now your brother in B. But even person where they born from the same belly with you, if you no love them, um, that person no fit be your brother. The most important thing for this life now love. But Benjamin here to love you. So now your brother you be. You no go want if you go play boss or go. Let your twin brother come, come carry you up, celebrate you. You no go want them. You love him. You no love him. Talk to me again. Talk to me again. Yes, I don't want this kind of thing. Okay, you don't lose guard again. You will be my guy. I know they lose guard. You will be to be a guy. You will be this one. But I tell him you love him. Tell me, I love you so much. And nothing can. You are not that. my twin brother. We all know the truth now. Yes, we all know the truth. He's not my twin brother. Sure, you know, say you be my guy. Sure, you know, say anytime where person find your problem, I mean, you'd always call report give, and I mean, you'd always find a solution to the problem. Now, you won't fall my hand, you won't lose guard, and it will make you make, make you the get a bad mind against your brother. If you tell you, say you love you, I won't make you request you tell him what, say you too love him, what, tell him, say you love him. I love you so much, I'm not going to change it, not even the devil. He's not my twin brother. Okay, I want to, this one now, I, I want to beg you, you know they lose guard. You're not, you're not a better person you be. Yeah? You remember that thing where I tell you, say for Swahili, then they say, Nakupenda. Nakupenda, it means say, I do love you. Tell them Nakupenda. Nakupenda! I'll give a hug, you go believe, accept them now. Give her organ back too. Mm. Okay. Boy, I tell him, see, I don't mark your face. I don't mark your face. Tell her your own, what? I don't mark your face. Boy, I hug him now. Hug him, you go green. He thought I'm done. Give her a hug. <laughs> hug him back. Boy, I tell him, see, I don't mark your face. I don't mark your face. And now, well, you see, I don't see small network for your face. Eh? I want to go for my own. Get something. <laughs> you understand? <laughs> yes, let me now. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I don't pass my face. That's not my voice. 
even if I give her back everything that she gave to me, I would never ever go broke. You see, <clears throat> before you married her, a lot of rich men, I mean men of high class, approached you to stay away from her. She changed our lives. I've never seen a woman love a man the way she loves you. If you must be truthful to yourself, you should know that everything you own today came from her. Does all that justify our evil acts? <laughs> evil acts indeed. <laughs> Do you want to kill a dog only because it ate the only food he kept for yourself? What about those days that helped you chase away thieves from your house? What about those days that helped you find the things you've lost? Huh? What about those days that helped you chase away harmful animals from your home? You see, I wonder why we magnify a single mistake or raise it over a hundred good deeds. So, Johnson, I must tell you, Regina loves you so much. And this is the reason she had to reject all this world of men and still choose you. Even when she knows you're not to her class. Come on, think about it, man. Not having a child is heavily threatening the love I have for her. I just want to get a new wife and have my own children. I'm, I'm, I'm losing it. You surprise me, you know. I mean, you're losing faith in someone that hasn't lost faith in you. Isn't that unfair? Because I think it's unfair. This woman made you as a nobody. She entrusted a lot of money in your hands. Not knowing your intentions of wanting to marry her. And let me remind you that she was already engaged. Yet she accepted to marry you and rejected her boyfriend. Man, I must tell you, if you lose Regina, I don't think you can ever find a woman like her again. I mean, you can find a woman that can be a rich child. Do everything but... Man, I must tell you, I don't think you can ever find a woman like Regina if you lose her. I don't think, because... Man, that woman loves you more than anyone can ever love you. So what do you and suggest I do now? The only thing I suggest you do is for you to join hands with your wife and find a possible solution to her problem. I believe your home can be good again. I believe so. Just think about it. All these years, you have shown me love. You have shown me love. Oh.
to talk with you. Really? Yes. I hope all is well. Now tell me, what is it? I've always been angry with you. Because of the way you love and care for my brother more than you do to me. But I've forgiven you. How? Oh. I told you nobody hates you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay? Um, there is something I want you to know. I am so sorry for everything. Okay? I am so, so sorry for everything. I appreciate it that you have forgiven me. And I promise you, I will not treat you any less again. I will okay. always be there for you. I will always make you happy. Okay? Okay. okay. Oh. And that, in closing, my mother, I'll never be happier than to see you and my mother live in peace again. Dad, please. You will not understand, son. Your mother offended me. The same way you offended me. But I forgive you. Why can't you do the same to my mother? You're still awake and you're crying. What is it? <laughs> what is it? When do you plan to serve me the divorce papers? <laughs> you think I'm going to let you leave my house? My 
idea. I can't let you go. I can't allow you to leave my house. If you leave, where do I find someone like you? <laughs> if I let you go, how do I find a replica? How do I find a replica? How do I find someone that will make my heart and make me feel that the whole world doesn't exist anymore? <laughs> to lose you. Please stop crying, my love, okay? For giving you. Are you serious? Oh, yes. You know, I told you I will not leave you no matter what. I realized myself happiness is all that matters. Okay? I'm so sorry for everything. I'm, I'm here sorry. for you. You're welcome. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You're welcome, baby. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Because your past is not a mistake if you can learn from me. One never feature of you. Feature me up and I want to. Hey! Mm. Nah. Hi. Hi. I don't even know that he has been deceiving us since. Hi. Where are Jiran and Andy? He's using us to take people's land from them. Hey. Nah. I don't know what to do. Mm. The middle thing now is the money that the man gave to, gave to me mm. has finished. You, you, you know, to me. I feel like hiding my face in shame. You know what? I, 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 I can't even say, I can't even come to the community and talk. Eh? Oh, you can't take home and say, I won't put it down, ma'am. Oh, yes, I'm going to roll. I'm going to roll. I'm going to roll. Hey! I'm going to kill you. The man just messed us up. Chai! Expose everything. Nah. But, 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 but. But will you blame us? The money involved. We can go and adjure Gajo. Hey, if you need money, that they have some some moves to live or days. I say young one, I say young one. Hey, or then they're making. What is he living for? No, we can't make it. Just help me talk to Eric. Tell him to give me back my son. I don't know why they've refused to give me back my baby. Honey, say. I know how it feels to raise a child to this age and realize that the child is not yours. But I've apologized to them. But I want you to calm down, okay? They are going to bring back Benjamin to you. Okay? But I don't want you to worry them. They're still your family. Okay? We all know the truth. And I'm sure that Benjamin will realize that you're the mother. I just want him to come and live with me for a while. I want to have him call me mother. Of course, he's going to call you mother. Not only him, but we're going to have children that will call us mommy, daddy, mommy, daddy. Okay? I can't wait to have kids for you. 
I cannot wait to give you your own. You will. You know, the doctor said that the root of all these problems has been discovered. So very soon, you are going to be fine. Okay? You'll be fine. Come on. Hmm? In for South Africa tomorrow. Oh. And your brother's exam starts tomorrow too. Yes. So he will not be going with you. Hmm? Yeah, he's fine. He's fine. I understand. I know you will miss him. But don't worry yourself. He will soon be back. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Be with a trophy. <laughs> um, Kingsley, your coach promised me that everything has been sorted out. Hmm? So you'll be comfortable in South Africa and you will play well. All I need you to is to do what? Deliver. Hmm? Thank you, Dad. You're welcome. I promise that I'll make all of you proud. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so, you have anything to say? I wish you all win the match and come back with the trophy. Mm -hmm. I pray so. You pray so? Yes. And, Dad. Yeah, what is it? You know, Akbati is my best friend. And he discovered this talent in me. Since this is my first tournament, I want him to travel with me. Oh, really? Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. No problem. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. I'm sick for you, okay? Don't worry yourself. Hmm? You'll be fine. I'm going to miss you, but I bought some um, kits for you. I want you to be smart. I want you to make us proud too. Hmm? Okay, I Good luck. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, so, well. Okay, Angela. I've come to see you for the last time. Uh, why are you? Sorry, this can't be the last time we'll be seen. You come strong again someday. Okay? Imagine. I'm tired of this world. I think it's time for me to go and rest. Come on, don't talk like that. <coughs> So, so. Okay, you, know, you know I have tired this world. I have seen all. But I think it's time for me to go and meet my maker. Don't talk like that, no. <sighs> What is this? These are the documents for my remaining assets. Please give it to my son. <clears throat> I don't want him to suffer penury while he's moving around the world. I wish I will see him before I say goodbye to the world. Sorry, sorry. sorry. Uh, you see, I I will try as much as possible for you to say. I will do anything whatsoever to make sure that you see him. It's okay, you'll be good. There is nothing in this world. Thank you.
This is good. I saw Kinsley on the news. He scored about six goals in two matches. <laughs> yes. For real. <laughs> well, um, Gina's children are doing us proud. Mm -hmm. My children. Oh, yes. <laughs> Benjamin and um, Kinsley are your children. I'm sorry for making you look like a liar. But the fact remains, it doesn't matter if we are the one that took care of them or you are the one that raised them. All that matters is that they are our children. They are free to come here anytime. Okay? We are one family. Oh, Eric. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine, okay? It's okay. It's okay. Mm. Come here. Mm. We are one family now. This issue shouldn't separate us. Okay? Baby sister. So, what is, as I was saying, what are you going to for? Oh, no, you're going to have it. If you see game, okay? Oh, poor, even that. Oh, yeah, we're going to go. I was so surprised, man. This is the worst. Yes. Mom, I love you. <laughs> Jennifer, honestly, I am really sorry about everything. Come on. I believe it all happened for good. Well, at least we are back again as one big happy family. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> uh huh. That reminds me. Papa called. He said he wants us home. And we should also make sure we come home with Benjamin. You know, he called me too and said the same thing, which is one of the reasons I came with my husband. Okay then, I think we should really go home at least to let him know that we're back as one happy family. You know, I am pretty sure that Papa and Mama will be so happy to hear that. <laughs> oh, cheers. Mm. <laughs> Well, I am happy to see both of you together again. We're just together again. Happy together again. <laughs> <laughs> um, Papa, nothing can separate my sister and I. The kids are ours, so there's no point dragging whose kids they are, right? Just say that again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> It's good. Um, I think it's time to review this to you. Oh. 
What is it again, Mama? What is it again? I am not your biological mother. What? what? Mama. Mama, you must be joking. I, I don't understand. We grew up knowing that you are our mother. Papa. Um, your mother died after giving birth to Gina. Jennifer, I was your mother's maid when she was alive. Jenny, you were four months old when your mother took in for Gina. The day your mother died, it was the same day your brother was taken away. So, your father decided to marry me and I raised you as my children. This is so deep. So deep for you both to keep it away from us for all this while? Sorry about this. I, I wanted her to be comfortable in it. And I didn't just want you to see her as a stranger. We're sorry about this. We're so sorry. Um, Mama. How come you never had your own children? I lost my womb when I was still your mother's housemaid. That time she was pregnant for Gina. I had something to do with your father. What? And as a result of that, I got pregnant. In a bid to hide that from your mother, I went for an abortion. A few months after the death of your mother, I started having complications in my life. So I decided to go for my medical check. The doctor then told me that my womb was seriously damaged as a result of the three abortions I had for your father. Shit! So, your father decided to marry me and we agreed to make you my children and promised never to reveal it to you. But as you can see, nothing remains hidden forever. That was why I I thought it wise to let you know about it now. Why? Actually, not me. Make 
good for our group. I will soon not be a good husband. But I need you to forgive me, please. I know this is deep and not easy for you to handle. But please. Please forgive. Oh. Oh, You're a nice woman. I mean, you raised us against all birds. So, I forgive you for everything I wrote against you. Oh, thank you. Thank you, my daughter. much as this is difficult for me. I forgive you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I forgive you. Thank you. Thank you. Let's take this boy to see his father. He deserves to see his son before he dies. Papa, over my dead body will I do that? Oh. You see. He has been here on several occasions, begging me to grant him his last wish. You see, he will not take the, the boy away from here. He just wants to see him before he dies. I do not want to ever set my eyes on him, ever again. Um, Gina, it's been over 10 years since the incident happened. I mean, you should have gotten over everything by now. You see, you see, he gave me this file. You know, it contains the documents of his remaining assets. And he asked me to give it to your boy. You, you, you need to, you know, let him see him before he dies. That tells you he loves the little boy. Please. Papa, you see this file? Please take it back to him. Because my son and I would not have anything to do with this file or him. So please take it back to him. Mommy. I want to see him. Please. Don't deny me the privilege of knowing who my biological father is. Please, mom. Baby, come. That man is a very wicked man. Do not call him father, okay? Please, mom. I want to see him. Please. Um, Gina, please. Okay? Even if you don't want to go there, just permit us to go with the boy. Allow him to know who his real father is. Please. Oh, my God. 
It's me, Obi Ajulu. You see, like I promised you, your son is here. Yes, your son is here. His name is Benjamin. Your son is here. Your son. Please. Oh, Benjamin, come. come. Yes, his name is Benjamin. My son! Yes, Papa. Son! If I can't do for you, 